At this year's Get Ready Eva Beach Emergency Preparedness Fair, area residents learn how they could be better prepared for the next natural or man-made disaster. Emergency preparedness is about protecting yourselves before government can help you. As you know, when there is a natural disaster, or even a disaster made by man, in the first 24 hours, 48 hours, sometimes you're gonna have to take care of yourself first before government gets to you. And as you go around these various booths, you'll see exactly that occurring, where you can do things to make sure that your home is protected and that your families are protected. And that, yes, even your pets are protected. And we're trying to get everybody encouraged to have at least seven days worth of food and water, but also to try to work up to about three months. Most people don't realize that if you have to evacuate your home and go to a shelter, like we have set up over here, you don't, won't be getting any water and you won't be getting any food. So with food, if you stick a little bit extra in, under your bed, um, in a closet, and just even rotate it, we have some products that will last 25 years and it's really good tasting. It doesn't taste like cardboard. So we encourage you to at least start with seven days and work up to at least a minimum of three, three months. This year's theme was Do You Know Where to Go for Shelter? Disaster experts were on hand to help residents understand when they should shelter in place or evacuate. A triage tent was set up outside for participants to walk through. But for those who cannot stand up, yep, you can yep, yep, like yep, injured. Yep, exactly. Yep. We'll just push them along. Yep, we'll just, just yep. push them. Yep. They get clean you as they go. Them. Yep. Then you clean them. Then you take them out the other side, put them on a gurney. City, state, and federal agencies participated in the event. This is the fourth year the grassroots group EVA Emergency Preparedness Committee sponsored the fair. They do it because they love all of you and they're worried about your families and you and they want to make sure that you're safe during a natural disaster. So we want to thank all of you for your hard work and many of these members have been doing this for four years volunteering their times in the evenings, during the day, their own money, their families. So thank you very much. Thank you so much, committee.